Last year certainly had its fair share of memorable moments. Let us hope for the same, perhaps better, this time round. Well, when it comes to major European trophies, Peter, this is one of those eagerly awaited days on the footballing calendar. I think changes to the format have increased interest levels and the emphasis on, on victories is more pronounced now. And hopefully these two will go at it accordingly and we can enjoy this. So we're up and running. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's got through. Oh, that is asking for trouble. He's looking to get there first. There will be a throw in. Hit into the middle. That was always going to be the keepers. Gets into a dangerous position. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. And it's played forward. That's a throw. Gets it back. This game is in need of some excitement. It needs help, and it's down to the creative and striking talent to up their game and, and give this crowd something to cheer about. Chance! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of him. He may have been thinking about back page headlines there. Goes for the cross. That's a case of crossing and hope, and unless they provide some more options, it'll be more missed than hit. Now he's had a go! Goal! Ludogorets! And it's Ludogorets who take the lead. Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Ludogorets take the lead, 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. It 
That's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? And he's cut it out. It's being played forward. And that's one way to annoy his teammates. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Dragovic. Dragovic drives it forward. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Tries to switch the play. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So there you have it, a close-fought half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. More than decent game up to now. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well, there's good movement off the ball, the passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Ludogorets come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting, and there is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. Has a hit! Forward it goes. Ludogorets just about have their noses in front. It is the slenderest of leads. Floats one over. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them show the ambition and adventure to go further ahead. But it seems as if they settle for a, a riskier approach now to defend this. Uh, it's a poor throw that, picked off with relative ease. Quick pull forward. Done very well to intervene. Dragovic. Hoists it forward. He's got options out wide. Time to deliver. Oh, sweet feet. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Big chance! And he's there to hoof it away. Tries to get it forward quickly. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Well, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Ludogorets, Rosgrad certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. 
And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Ludogorets have got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one, and it bodes well for the campaign ahead. Your reflections then, Jim. Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive...